India is a land with an ancient soul but a modern heartbeat. From ancient times, India has made extraordinary contributions in the field of architecture, astronomy, cartography, metallurgy, logic, mathematics, medicine and many other disciplines. However, there is another discipline that originated in India and is well known to the modern world. That is Yoga. Yoga acquired a new dimension when in December 2014, the United Nations declared June 21st to be celebrated every year as the International Day of Yoga. But yoga did not begin on June 21st. It began centuries ago. Yoga has transcended time and boundaries. This 5,000-year-old discipline was brought to the shores of the Western world in the late 19th century. In its dissemination across the world over the last 150 years and thanks to the contributions of yoga pioneers and contemporary yoga gurus like Gurani Anjali, Yogi Sunita, Krishnamacharya, Joyce, Iyengar, Jagi Vasudev, Sri Sri Ravi Shankar and Baba Ramdev to name a few. Yoga as we know today has undergone significant transformation from the 5,000 year old ancient discipline of the sages. Yoga is practiced today by millions of people around the world. Realizing the virtues and holistic benefits of yoga for all mankind, the Honorable Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi, in his address to the 69th session of the United Nations General Assembly in New York in September 2014, proposed that the world should start celebrating an International Day of Yoga. Yoga is our Puranthan Paramparik Amulya Dein. योग केवल व्यायाम भर न होकर अपने आप से तथा विश्व व प्रकृति के साथ तादादमय को प्राप्त करने का माध्यम है यह हमारी जीवन शैली में परिवर्तन लाकर तथा हम में जागरूकता उत्पन्न करके जलवायु परिवर्तन से लड़ने में सहायक हो सकता है आइए हम एक अंतरराष्ट्रीय योग दिवस को आरंभ करने की दिशा में कार्य करें। Member countries of the United Nations supported this call, and the UN proclaimed June 21st as the International Day of Yoga. There was special significance in choosing June 21st as the International Day of Yoga. The summer solstice falls on 20th to 21st June when the rays of the sun directly strike one of the two tropical latitude lines. June 21st being the longest day of the year marks the beginning of summer in the northern hemisphere and heralds the beginning of winter in the southern hemisphere. As the longest day of the year begins and as people wake up to a new dawn in their time zones, thousands of them get ready to reach for their yoga mats and a dose of health well-being, peace and harmony.
the stage was set on the iconic boulevard Rajpath in New Delhi to bring people of diverse beliefs, nationalities and age groups to come together not only to do yoga but create a new awareness of peace and harmony. The Yoga Day celebration on Rajpath set a Guinness World Record for the largest yoga lesson at a single venue with 35,985 people performing yoga at once. It broke a previous 10-year-old record set in India in the city of Gwalior in November 2005 with people of 84 different and unique nationalities taking part in this event. A second Guinness World Record was also set for the most nationalities in a yoga lesson. June 21st is no longer just the longest day in the year. It is now the International Day of Yoga, a day when people across the world come together to practice this age-old discipline to take care of their health and well-being. Seek mental peace and happiness and attain synergy between body, mind and spirit. The word yoga is derived from the Sanskrit word yug, meaning to unite. Fittingly, yoga has united the modern world on this day and forever. <laughs>